Okay, so the purpose of the webinar is to get people to know, like, and trust you. The longer your webinar is, the more inclined they are to buy. Does the phone funnel here, is the, where's the webinar portion of this where people know, like, and trust you and want to buy? Where does that fit into this phone funnel? It's a fantastic question. Um, so actually, the origins, the webinar starts on the next page. So we just tell the origin story portion. And then we take the exact same stories that I would tell for story number one, two, and three. That's the theme of the next day's emails. Story one, story two, story three. And then we have the final offer and the close. That is literally the anatomy of a sales letter. And so that's the exact same reason. Recap of the origin story, story one, story two, story three, right there at the top. And so we do that on every single thing. It's why I'm such a good affiliate for ClickFunnels. I write a webinar every time I promote something every time. And it might be an hour and a half, it might be five minutes. Still the same format though. I'm just adhering to the principles that cause desire and momentum and motion in people's brains, the buying, the buying emotion. It makes sense. That's why these funnel types, you can use it for anything. If I deliver one right now, I'm the funnel, right? But I'm just going to go and make the funnel match the business type that you're in. Still the same script, the same copy throughout on all the pages. Yeah, we uh, get the blue box of wisdom. Uh, quick question regarding like when to use the webinar funnel versus the phone funnel. Um, have you ever tried, or what's your experience when you do a, a webinar, but the call to action at the end, you know, usually it's to get on a phone call with someone. Actually, that is what we are doing for Offer Lab right now. Okay. So and, we're gonna. What, do when would you use it? I guess. Kind of um, a lot of times, that. price point. Okay. If the price point is, is a little bit higher, it's very unlikely someone's going to be like, oh, $25,000 on an order page. Let me just put my credit card info in, you know? <laughs> That's very <laughs> unlikely. And so that in those scenarios where you're like, that price point feels like a barrier in my customer's mind. Let's get on the phone with them. I still would do a webinar, but instead of saying, go to offerlab.com forward slash start to get started, I would say, go right here and fill out the application because we only have 10 spots this month. We want to work with 10 people. That's it. What's that price point range? Five grand and up or would you oh, usually? Oh, um, what are you selling? Um, done for you service. What is it? Lead generation. Are they used to spending five grand? Uh, they could, some. Or my who, <laughs> when I change my who, definitely. They can spend up towards 15 grand. So then you should probably be like 18. Okay, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, in that scenario though, yeah, I would, I would do a phone funnel. Okay. I think so, yeah. Thanks. Thanks, man. So would you, would you, would you sell um, your, for this, I've got a 1997 product and a um, $24,000 product. So which one do I need to focus on first? The higher, the higher or the, the middle of the value letter? Yeah, I think of like uh, the products that I said. Like, so like this one, in the past, it's been called something for the back end of the value ladder. That is not true. That's why we don't call it that anymore. It's a middle. It's a phone funnel. So it can be a middle, it can be a bottom, it can be a top. It's whatever you choose. Um, I would just choose, ask yourself, if you have like, who has multiple products already right now? Figure out which one brings the kind of person that you want to work with the most. Try and make that the core of your entire thing if you can. Right, like we'll, we'll have one more, actually two more tiers after, after this program. Um, and it's, anyway, does that help? Just choose one thing for the purpose of Offer Lab. And what we should ask yourself is like, what can I get rid of and still have my dream customer? Like my affiliate stuff, that is not my, that is not my dream customer, it's just not. But I'm one of the top affiliates at ClickFunnels. It's because of these funnel types. Um, and so, but I could easily get rid of all the products there and, and, and that's fine. I could easily get rid of everything in OfferMind, funny enough, even though I love it dearly. I could get rid of OfferMind and just be left with you guys, right? And I'd be like, I'm satisfied. This is awesome. I love you guys. I want to work with you, <laughs> right? And, uh, and so this is the core of my whole value ladder. It's not so much a, a question of price points. It's who do you want? Who do you want to work with? Let's build a business you like, you know? Yeah. Alrighty. So will we have access to the, figure out how to build a 
like if we choose the phone funnel and then we know we need a webinar funnel later, will we have access to anything to like give that to a funnel building team or anything? If we need two funnels? Yeah, so we'll just build one here. I know, but will we have access to like wait to the email copy or anything like that? Oh yeah, you know what's funny is it's largely the exact same email sequence for every funnel type. Okay, cool. Basically. So it's the same principles throughout it. Awesome. So the funnels that you see me doing this with, and some of them are not out yet. Um, that one on the top right, that's Titans of Industry. That's uh, the name of my mastermind. I'm sick of everything being con or live, so I made OfferMind. <laughs> uh, OfferCon. And the same thing with masterminds. Like, I hate masterminds that are just like, you sit there and you just talk the whole time. I want to do something um, very... I mean, I think I probably walked a mile up here already. You know what I mean? I move a lot. <laughs> I can't sit that long, and that's why we do so many workshops, too, if you guys are the same way. Um, but uh, so it's a destination-based mastermind. So we're going to go bring you cool places. And the focus, while this is to build the middle of your value ladder, that is a mastermind, but meant to plug into my funnel team to build the back end so that you get paid. Like I was talking about, you know, it makes sense? Anyway, um, the blue fist there, that's the joinmydownline.com. You can see a live version of this. Um, and then this offer lab is the same funnel we use to sell that as well. 